I am really excited this season for our team to be at the Owings Mills East Campus, to be able to play on an unbelievable Bermuda grass field, to be even to practice on a Bermuda grass field is not a lot of programs in Division Three can say that, as well as Division One and Division Two. So for our team, we want to make that our home. We want to be able to build tradition there, history there. We played three games on it last season. Gettysburg, we lost 3-2. They were number 23 in the country at the time. Marymount, we knocked off 2-0. They made the NCAA tournament, won their, their conference, the Atlantic East. And then we also um, tied with uh, Mary Washington, so went to the final four. So we played really well in that field. It suits our style of play. So I'm really excited that we'll be there to play all our home games and playoff games and hopefully NCAA games as well. This non-conference schedule is built by me to get this team ready for a MAC conference play. It's for them to play against really competitive teams that we would see in the NCAA, that we're gonna see in conference. And so we need to use those games to prepare our team for the adversity and the battles that we face in the MAC and, and hopefully in the playoffs in NCAA tournament. Every year we go into the, to the season, non, we, we split it into two. Non-conference, we wanna obviously be as strong as we can to prepare for conference play, having Messiah, perennial powerhouse in the MAC, you know, we need to win those games non-conference if we want to have a chance at large. So soccer season starts right away. There's no, no room for error. So starting that first weekend all the way through the season, compete better than we did last year. Uh, I thought we competed well, but I didn't think we were quite as ruthless in front of goal and that led to a lot of ties. And then obviously once we get to conference play, there's only eight teams now. We want to be in the top four. We want to give ourselves the best opportunity to, to be successful in the MAC playoffs and, and go on to the NCAAs, which men's soccer has never done. Returning wise, we have got a great group of guys coming back. They really have bought into the culture that we're trying to set. It's competitive. It's, um, it's always pushing each other to be better on and off the field. They will bring a lot. We had some uh, leadership changes with our seniors that graduated from last year. Uh, so we made some changes this spring. We feel we've got the right leaders in place um, to help take this team to the next level and also to help guide our big freshman class that's coming in. Our first year class, I am really excited about. We have got a great group. We were able to um, recruit from all over, you know, kudos to my uh, coaching staff, especially Bill Kerr, my assistant coach. I think I sent him everywhere we possibly could over this last year to really, really help get a class in that can help build this team and, and give us depth in every position. So we're really excited. We've got um, players coming from New Jersey, Pennsylvania, um, a lot coming from the Northern Virginia area, as well as always with Maryland. Uh, this first year group is a large group. Uh, and we expect them to hit the ground running right away when we start preseason and be able to compete for playing time and, and give us the depth that we need to play the kind of soccer that we want, relentless pressing and uh, get more goals. I would just like to say to the Stevenson community, please come out and watch your games over at the Owings Mills East Campus. It's a short walk from the North Campus. It's gonna be beautiful out there. There's always a breeze. There's a great hill to sit on. We're gonna provide some awesome soccer, awesome football, that's the way it should be called. We're gonna have, um, you know, it's gonna be a great, great place to watch games. So I would encourage you to get over there, especially in September when the weather's beautiful. Uh, come out and watch us. I think you'll be impressed with what we have to offer.